I would have to say Michael Bublé because he just, he just did such an amazing job in Sleeping Beauty when the part where he woke up and he was with all the, the dwarves. It's kind of like a father moment. I'm the oldest child, so I have to look out for my siblings. I just kind of relate to that. I would say my Disney spirit animal would be Maui. He's a really fun guy to be around. And also, you're welcome, people of Mr. Maple Mountain, for running for Mr. Maple Mountain. Okay, I would say my character would be like Li Shang, you know, he's Asian, up there with the master race. Can't really mess with the Asians, they're above, they're really smart. Then, you know, Talon's my underling, he's got that little fat Asian in him, just wants food, that's all they want for some reason, I don't know, just kick him sometimes. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, um, my answer would have to be Timon because I like to eat random things in the woods, like, you know, bugs and all that stuff. Just kidding, that's false. But I do talk a lot about pretty much nothing. I'd say the character I identify with most strongly has got to be Captain Hook. I mean, we both hate crocodiles, have luscious flowing locks, and we try and kidnap children. <laughs> I think the Disney character I most like has definitely got to be Hercules. But before he bulked up, you know, when he was just like the, scr like the scrawny little white kid, right? That always like ruined the town and destroyed everyone's lives. Yeah, no, I definitely feel that on like a hardcore spiritual level. Like that's just, that's me, you know? I just really feel that my Disney character would be John from WALL-E because I'm just really passionate about sitting in a chair all day long and drinking all my food out of a cup. I'd have to say the main character from Lone Rider because I'm all about that lone life, you know. Yeah. All right, I think the Disney character I'd have to be is probably Peter Pan personified because, I mean, we both love Wendy's and I low-key look like an eight-year-old boy. And yeah, that's about it. Jessica Rabbit, because I'm smoking hot. I'd have to say I'm the genie from Aladdin, because I'm witty and a ray of sunshine. I, I, my brains and attitude are always there to help save the day. Without me, there'd be no happily ever after. Okay, I'd have to say um, I related most to Kristoff from Frozen, because we're both rugged mountain men, and we both live in the snow, and he got the girl. Um, you know, that's a tough one. I'm going to have to say my, you know, my Disney uh, spirit animal is going to have to be my more bigger, wide-set friend, uh, Chen Po from Mulan. Um, obvious reasons, because, you know, I'm basically made out of food and he loves food, so what, what more can you get out of that? I would say Hercules, because me and him share many attributes, including our strengths and weaknesses, um, strengths including diameter in our biceps and thighs, and weakness, including, unfortunately, women. Um, they're amazing, but, you know, Hercules just loves world peace and education, and I do too. <sighs> the Disney character I am most like would probably be Genie from Aladdin because of how good I am at magic tricks. Watch. Gotcha.